There's a dear old sister who lived predom predominantly in the 1800s, but her name was Fanny Crosby. Dear Fanny was one of the most prolific and beloved hymn writers of all time. Some of the most well-known hymns and beloved hymns were written by this dear woman who, as an infant, was blinded. Well, hello again, dear friends. Thank you for joining us wherever you are today, and uh, we pray that all is well with you. To see his face is our title today, and we'll start off with a verse from John that says this. Philip said, Lord, show us the Father, and that will be enough for us. Jesus answered, Philip, have I been with you so long? After all I've been with all this long time I've been among you, Whoever has seen me has seen the Father. Well, we all have loved ones, don't we, that have passed on, whose faces we'd love to see again. Uh, my dear mother has been away from me now for over 60 years. And uh, I would love to see her face again. I would love to hear her voice, a voice that I can no longer even remember. But I know that it, during my childhood, it soothed me very often. There's a dear old sister who lived predom predominantly in the 1800s, but her name was Fanny Crosby. Dear Fanny was one of the most prolific and beloved hymn writers of all time. Some of the most well-known hymns and beloved hymns were written by this dear woman who, as an infant, was blinded and lived virtually all of her 95 years totally blind. And she once told someone with great joy that she was so glad that the first face she would ever see would be that of her Lord Jesus. Think about that for a second. Wow. How about you, dear friend? Do you long to see his face? Don't we long to see the face of that one who loved us and gave himself for us? That one who bore our sins in his own body on the tree, who endured such shame and suffering uh, on our behalf? Oh, we would long to see his face, wouldn't we? And that happy day, that never-ending day, <clears throat> up there in glory, uh, we will be in his glorious presence forever and always we will be enjoying his sweet presence for all eternity we can look upon him at that time we've not seen his face now but we will see it then there's a precious old hymn i'll close by quoting what it says and god has fixed the happy day when the last tear shall dim our eyes when he will wipe these tears away and fill our hearts with glad surprise to hear his voice, to see his face, and know the fullness of his grace. Well, dear ones, thank you again. I trust there's been something here that has touched your heart today. Thank you once again for joining us, and the Lord bless and keep you till we see you again. So long.